yeah, it was hard. It was a hard fight. There was so many war lads just hitting the 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 power or the or, or the energy to stick with it, like you know, and they took it back to you. And that's grand. That's grand. But in fairness to the lads that stuck with it, it it was it it, it, it exhumed our lives. It exhumed our lives. We we were travelling to Dublin on occasions maybe two or three times a week. We were at, at our own expense. We were travelling to we were reading I recall the first time I ever met the Weed of Cape, one of the bravest people I've ever met in my life. The, we actually had a meter on, on the way from Warsaw, so we had to go down to Mellos and it was late, it was about eight o'clock and we were and it took us hours to get from train home. It was like a midnight train <laughs> between the catching of the trains from Mellos to connect them and delivery. And that's the first time I met that lady when we spoke with that lady and the, the, the honesty and the truth of how, what she had gone through had landed home with us, you know. And we met her a couple of times since. Uh, I have nothing but total admiration for him. Plus the fact, when she came to Europe, at a drop of a hat, she said, yeah, I'll go with you, I can help you, I'll go with you, came over to Europe to make a case for her. Professor Connor O'Mahony, UCC, has been a Trojan. Mm-hmm. He's been a death. Uh, a man that I haven't actually met, but I think we became friends over the internet on it. We spoke so many times, and any time he came out, he would have not shot him coming on and explaining what was happening to us, you know. He was very good. Just if we can get back to life. It, it, it's closing one big chapter, it's closing one door, and by meaning that it opening up so many more doors. We can sit down and have our coffee and have our chapter today, so we can talk about the Holland Met. I, I actually haven't spoken to any of my friends about the Holland Met last week, and that's what have been the ma- most amazing game that was ever seen, like, you know. So I haven't spoken to him about the about the Lions tour there. Now I would have the Lions tour on and last year's Lions tour on here and tonight. They're not on that, you know. It's just that we're concentrating on this, finish this, but we want to put the nail in the coffin here on this one and then get on our lives. Lots of people who haven't lived to see this day. There must be a sense of emotion as well for you. Uh, I, I, I won't name them, but there is a lot of people that have passed. A lot of our class have passed away, you know. It's a... Uh, one way or another, and, and yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want to tell them that I just, if, if they were there, I just tell them, look, we're doing our best for you. Right. Maybe to their families, it, it's probably, it's, it's, it's probably, um, the divorce wouldn't be, wouldn't be any good down to their family, or it won't do them any good, but look, they were right, simple as that, they were right all along. And, uh, as I said, we had so many people stuck by your truth. But as that's all done and dusted now, and that scheme is up, it's up and running, we'll give it a couple of weeks for it to get its teeth, to get its legs, it's in the front end. We'll see if it's suitable, and if it's not, then if it is, we'll accept it and we'll close the doors. If it's not, we might have to start the campaign again. Yes.